Hi everyone, so I'm going to do question 8-2-1 from the booklet and we're going to talk about strictly equals to now. So let's do this problem here. It says initialize the variable called if initialize the variable called okay, I did not put a value, so let's say called num to the value of 12 uh, called num to the value of 12. All right, so let's do that first. We'll, so we'll do var num is equal to 12. Now, because it's initialized, we're just putting it all on one line. Then it says here, then check to see if num is strictly equal to the string data type of five. So because we're using strictly equals to, we have to use the three equals sign. So what we have to do is we have to do console.log num, and we have to see strictly equals, three equals sign, to the value of five. It's a data type of five. So data type string is using those quotes right there, semicolon. So what we're gonna do now is we're trying to compare this num we're grabbing this num right here, and so num is 12, so we put 12 right here. So does 12 strictly equal to the number of five? Well, strictly equal to still checks the number value. So does 12 equal to five? No. So either way, even if we check the data type, because this is a string, and this is a number, which is an integer, they're not the same data type, this is an integer and that is a string so it is false as well so as long as there's one false they're both false so the answer will be false so if we run this here as well node test.js you can see here that we get the answer of false as well here